everybody, ReaperX1 here again, playing some more TerraTech in the R&D, and I got another vehicle for my naval fleet. This time is my, my navy sub, or my attack sub. Got a whole little idea going here for a team. It's been a while since I built a whole team, so I thought, yeah, why not? So as most of us know, you know, the navy has big battleships, destroyers, and all that kind of stuff, but they also have the smaller stuff. So let's get into another little vehicle in this attack sub as I welcome you and I do thank you for joining me and let's see if we can make another good one happen so what it is it's basically a hovercraft just to fake out the floating in water and so AI can hopefully control it too to some degree we'll worry about that a little later but right now what I want to do is just check her out see how she handles First of all, it'll do well, 75 mile an hour. That ain't bad at 21 feet. So pretty good, pretty good. And I'm going to start with these right here. And as you can see, we even got the big battleship. Oh, that was nice. Battleship cannon on it. So I am liking that. Just annihilating everything. Oh, it takes that apart real quick. Ah, I'm liking that. Didn't take long at all, eh? Let's see if we can manage the brick. I think we'll be able to take it out. It's just a matter of how long it'll take. That big cannon on the front, though, she's really putting in work on that, I think. We've already got blocks falling off it. Cruise missiles don't hurt either, you know? <laughs> The nice thing about the big battleship can is if you start getting too close to something, it gives you that little bit of kickback. <laughs> well, we already got the bubbles pretty much down. Just picking at it. So I'm kind of curious as to see how long this will take. I'm not timing it or nothing. I just know if I get bored of watching it, then it's taking too long. But so far, so good. We can stay on one side. We'll do a lot better. We'll dig deeper into it. Get that battleship cannon back on there. We're missing. Oh, that well, looks like all the bow. Oh, there it goes. That was not that long at all. So really nice. I'm liking that. Now you know we do have to test her out on something a little more lethal. So let's. Well. I was going to start with these turrets, so let's just get on with that, just because I'm near here. But I want to, hey, sound went away with the propellers for a second. But I want to go and attack these ones back here. Now, it is a little harder to steer than my other one that I got built up, the drone and the plane. But this thing has got a little more firepower. And it goes backwards quite nicely too, so it all works out pretty good. <laughs> oh yeah, they're not lasting very long. They're going to have a hard time doing any damage, real damage to this thing. This might though. Oh wow, the bubbles are gone already. I thought it would have put up more of a fight than that. But it did knock us down a little bit on our battery, so I'm going to scoot over by... Whoa, easy girl, easy. Should we take out the sign? Let's do it. We should. Don't want to leave nothing out, eh? Keep hitting stuff, though. Boom! That puts a big hole in it. Oh, that just devastates it. The little avalanche launchers, they keep the heat on everything. So, so far, so good. We've taken out them targets and well that new turret the bolt turret explosive bolts are used on that one that's a new addition since they've been trying to get those into the population pretty nice addition i think i've had a couple enemies in my campaign that have used them well back up we want a full battery we're going against all them turrets over there all right well, that should be good oh hit it now, I was thinking of putting bombs on this, but it didn't get high enough. I was going to use the other, uh, the Venture Hover Pads. 
But they're just making everything shake so bad, I didn't really want to use them. They'll probably work at some point, and at that point, well, who knows, maybe I'll change them out. Holy crap, just taking them out before I even see them. Nice. <laughs> Maybe we should hold off on the firing, but no, we're not giving nothing a chance. We gotta keep as much battery as we can for when we get to these last couple turrets that are coming. Ooh, this guy's putting up a fight. Was putting up a fight. If we're not as maneuverable, like, look at that, this is chewing up our batteries. We better hold on a sec here. Don't want to die too easy. We'll hide here. Can't hit us. Being sneaky like. <clears throat> okay, now we're almost out of battery, so I don't know how good this is going to go. We're going to have to play the more smart, strategic style of this, not just running through them. Got to realize that our tech isn't big enough to do that kind of stuff. We're going to run out of battery here right shortly, probably after one hit. One good hit will take us to, oh, like that one. Yep, that was the rail gun, so let's see what we can do. Oh, is that the missile tech? That was the missile turret. Nice! We got them all! Look at that! See, being smart with your maneuvering. We lost one block there. And I think that was it. So that's not too bad. I'd say that's a success. Especially for a little tech like this to clear the R&D. All enemies are dealt with. Now, I don't think this one's going to do so great in, say, races and maneuverability and stuff like that. But, why not try it? Can't hurt, can it? Shouldn't hurt. Nah, I'm not even going to worry about fixing it. Let's see what we can do on that long race. That should be this one here. I got a feeling it's going to be pretty short because we're going to go out of bounds, but let's give her a shot. See if we can get our drift on here. Cause that's basically what you got to do. You got to play it like a drift. Those real tight turns are really going to put a hurting on us, I think. Oh, cutting that corner. Beauty. Oh. We might run out of time, actually, is what I'm just thinking of. Even if we can manage all these turns. Oh, don't do it, don't do it, don't do it. Oh, sliding right on the edge. Oh, look at us go, look at us go. Oh, this is a big one. I don't think I started early enough. Oh, so close. We were doing all right, though. But yeah, like I thought, we could probably try it a couple more times. We could get it. I think we, I think it's possible. But by the time we get it, it'd be an hour-long video, maybe. <laughs> this is just supposed to be kind of a little short one, just to kind of update you on what I've been working on. And... Who knows, maybe it'll inspire you to make your own little navy fleet. Because this I could even see being part of Nuteca at some point, if I get the whole idea to work. I was thinking of giving you a little hint as to what I'm going to be making, but I'll let you guys guess. And if you got any guesses, throw them down in those comments. You know, yeah, right under that like button that I hopefully, that uh, I'm hoping you'll hit, because uh, you think it deserves it. And from there, you know, if you want to keep up to date with what we got going on, all you gots to do is subscribe, ding that bell, and from there, you will be notified. So let's do this. Let's see how he follows. Damn, I missed him. I don't know if he's going away from me or I'm going away from him. There. Hang on with me. Let's see how he does. Moving out. Let him get himself figured out here. Yeah, looks like he's doing all right. Kind of keeping up. As long as you don't go full speed, they stay with you pretty good. Let's see how he likes circles. Just mess with them a little bit. Uh, not too bad, not too bad. A little oversteer on that one. He doesn't have the smoothness as, as the player controlled tech, but not too shabby. Maybe I should have left some enemies. We could have went and did some battling. Well, you know what we should do then? 
and just battle this out. Okay, charge! I'm shooting first, so. Haha, I got ya! <laughs> oh, uh oh. He got me! <laughs> Tie! Right on. I kind of expected that to happen. I'm just glad they put me right back into another one. So now, what do we got left to do? Nothing. We cleared out everything. So, not too shabby. I kind of like that one. But yeah, it's still just fun just to putt around and do 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 do. Try some trick driving. Not too many tricks this thing will do, but. It's still fun to play with. I don't know why. Okay, I'm pretty sure this isn't going to work, but I'm going to try this. If I can get lined up with it. Come on, girl. Oh, no, not happening. Well, I got up higher than I thought I would. Yeah, that gyro I got in there. Once again, I used the Horizon gyroscope. Pretty good, I like it. Nice and compact for what it does. I'm glad they finally entered, or, uh, put in some stronger gyros in the Venture ones. Because sometimes a gyro is needed. Especially on hover techs, I find it's really nice to have a gyro in there. Or enough of them, anyway. So I'm thinking that's a pretty good run through the R&D for our little uh, naval marauders. So up until that next time, you know what to do. Just keep being that awesome. Keep having a good one. Bye.